also in Rock County. For one Janesville area agency, drought is a word that describes a lot more than summer weather. NBC 15's Syra Onwer was in Janesville today and tells us how this Rock County charity is struggling to help the thousands of people that depend on its services. John Echo, a Rock County charity that has been in the Janesville community for 47 years, is working to fight a financial drought as weather and vacations take a toll on community generosity. So far we've been managing, but right now we're at a critical point. ECHO, an acronym for everyone cooperating to help others, is widely known for its food pantry, but its biggest impact is in rent assistance and lodging. You can't do a whole lot more with, if you don't have a roof over your head. You know, even our food po program is more usable if people have a roof over their head and a table to put it on. The organization, with its staff of 12 and 70 volunteers, helps about 14,000 people in Rock County, but not without struggles of its own. We're in tough shape right now. We're about to go into a bank loan. Last year was our worst year financially, 2015. Um, we were operating on a bank, bank loan for eight months out of, the, out of the 12 months. While this may look like a lot of food, ECHO provides people in need with 1.5 million pounds of food in a year. So as you might assume, they go through this supply pretty quickly. The toughest thing is being able to say no to somebody when the only reason you're saying no to them is because of the funding situation. We all love ECHO. It helps a lot. Thank you, ECHO, for all the help. This child is obviously very appreciative of, of the, the help you guys gave them. It's, it's nice because it, it shows that the kids, you know, realize, you know, that uh, they're getting help from us. People are busy taking vacations. People are thinking that we're doing okay, unless you remind them that we need some help. People just think everything's okay. ECHO serves about 40 families every day out of their Janesville office. If you'd like to help out, you can head to NBC15.com and click on this story.